Edwin Roberts Russell was an African-American chemist whose contributions to science during World War II had a profound impact on the development of nuclear technology. Russell held 11 patents for nuclear energy, including a method for separating plutonium from uranium and ion exchange absorption for plutonium separation. He was born in 1913 in Columbia, South Carolina. He earned a Bachelor of Science degree with honors in 1935 from Benedict College in Columbia. Next, he obtained a master's degree in chemistry from Howard University in 1937. While at Howard, from 1936 to 1942, he also taught as an instructor in the chemistry department. Russell joined the University of Chicago to pursue a Ph.D. in surface chemistry in 1942. His arrival coincided with the commencement of the Manhattan Project, a top-secret military project aimed at developing nuclear weapons. At the Metallurgical Laboratory, MetLab, Edwin Russell became an integral part of the team working on the isolation and extraction of plutonium-239 from uranium, a crucial step in creating atomic bombs. His work during these years from 1942 to 1947 was pivotal in the eventual production of the atomic bombs dropped in 1945, marking the end of World War II. Post-war, Russell became chairman of the Division of Science at Allen University in Columbia from 1947 to 1953. Here, he continued to influence the next generation of scientists. In 1953, Russell moved to the E.I. DuPont's Savannah River Nuclear Laboratory in Aiken, South Carolina, where he worked as a research chemist until his retirement in 1976. His focus at DuPont included projects on the treatment of radioactive waste, and he was involved in writing several classified publications in the field of nuclear energy. His work was so significant that he was awarded a series of U.S. patents for his experiments related to the Atomic Energy Program, showcasing his innovative approach to nuclear chemistry. He passed away in 1996.